Good evening, my name is Zoo and I hate video games. My name is Christy and I love video games. Presuming you can hear me. Yes. I would still love video games regardless. Whether you could hear her or not. Yes. It's not conditional. No. That would be weird. <laughs> I only like video games when you're listening. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna play some Monster Hunter. So, like, the thing is, I have had relationships like that, and they were bad relationships. Mm-hmm. Me too. Oh, no, your cough button only works on your mic. Oh. That's a shame. All right, let's... Let's... Let's see the thing to do. Need the tab. Cartoon Network's thing to do? Yes. You ever see those? No. Cartoon Network's thing to do was like a series of like interstitials uh, back in the day when it was basically just running like every episode of scooby-doo on a loop mm -hmm. leave it to me so the cartoon network's thing to do was like it had an intro and outro song and then uh the actual meat of the bit was like here's a cartoon network's thing to do pull a hammer out from behind your 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 back mm -hmm. it's like maybe you're being chased it just goes through like a very cartoon thing mm -hmm. It's like, maybe, uh, your enemy has painted a train track on a wall. And you, like, rush at the wall, but don't worry, you're gonna go right through it. And then, the bad guy tries to follow you, and oops, it just matters against the wall. Here we go. Very, very Roadrunner, very Tex Avery. Very, yeah, and they're using, like, clips. Mm hmm Uh, they're from. Mm-hmm. And they got um, some letters mm -hmm. because you probably shouldn't tell children to run headlong into a wall. <laughs> you probably shouldn't do that. Hey, kids, don't run headfirst into a wall. This has been a Squirrel Lily PSA. I wouldn't be the world's best duelist if I ran headfirst into a wall. Ain't that the truth. I don't even know what the hell I need. Did you send me a thing yet? Yes. Oh. I must have missed the pop-up. No, I just sent it. Oh, okay. I was uh, building, or I have to set up a lobby first, and then I can't, or and then I have to talk to the cat again to send the invite. Mm-hmm. Ah. Ah. Fun fact. Um. Wait. My soundboard's still up. Oh no. So, um, I went to type in the code to the, Stop. to the lobby, mm -hmm. and suddenly was blasted with, I'm sad, Randy. <laughs> Beautiful. The cat's bindle looks like, yeah, it does look like the, uh, the sonic boom or whatever, doesn't it? There was a name for it, and look, that looks like a Smash Brothers logo on it. Oh yeah, it does look like a Smash Brothers logo. Mm-hmm. That's wild. I wonder if that was on purpose. <laughs> yeah, since they put Rathalos in uh, Ultimate. That's true. It's Rathalos? Yeah. What would okay. You like to do? Put Palico in Smash. I wish Monster Hunter had made the cut. Palico's in Smash, I think. There's a Palico costume. And a Hunter oh, okay. costume. Not an assist trophy? No. Oh. 
I think Rathalos can be summoned via assist trophy as well as being a boss character. So, because everyone likes Rathalos, it's actually because Rathalos was the main antagonist in the terrible <laughs> Monster Hunter World movie. Oh, right. That it happened. Mm-hmm. Was it any good? Did you see it? It's, yeah, it's fucking terrible. It's visually stunning, and everything about it sucks. Mm. So, like Resident Evil. Right, that's a shame. Mm-hmm. Paul W.S. Anderson has a type, and it's films in which his wife can be hot. He also really likes getting all the details right visually, and that's all just visually. Oh, sure. All right, so we can hunt a high rank Zenogre, Somnicant, Barioth, Toby Karachi, mm -hmm. Anjanath, Nargakuga, and Rathalos. I think I don't have these quests. Master Hojo drew all the it's a uh, six star. We did the we did the urgent quest. It's very hard. You should have them. <laughs> Are you in the hub? Yeah, you're in the hub. Yeah. Yeah, just go to the six star. Oh, I've gathered ore. Oh, and hunted high rank monsters and acquired perma buffers. That's good. Mm hmm. Oh, okay, yeah, I've just now gotten the six star quest. Yeah. Right, that's the whole thing. Um, These are the available quests. I don't know what all the hell I need. I think Nargakuga has critical stuff. Mm hmm. Let's hunt a Nargakuga. All right. I like that it's called the Abyss Stairs Back. Yep. The spirits protect you. I know a Nargakuga Catboy, and I really like him. Well, that's nice. Let's see, what are we looking at here? Nargakuga is, of course, uh, weak against Thunder, because mm -hmm. everything in this goddamn game is weak against Thunder for some reason. Seriously, there's so many Thunder-weak monsters in this. They don't do... Uh, Nargakuga doesn't do elemental damage, right? I don't think so. I think it's all physical, and it might add bleed? That sounds right. No, bleed's not even in the game anymore. I forgot that, that they removed bleed. Right. I think it used to use bleed. Hmm. They decided to streamline the status ailments, too. The problem there being that uh the point of there being separate status for poison and bleed was that you had to do different things to remove them yeah. having trouble understanding what damage thunder does uh acdc does acdc uh. damage because they get thunderstruck Fighter, of course. It would be silly for me not to do fighter. Deflector, sure. And rider. Ride, rider, ghost. Ride of the Kuga. You can see his stripes, and you know he's mean. Go, go, Nargakuga. Um. I just take the sleep. Mm hmm? The sleep dongo. Did you take the sleep dongo? I could. I don't know which one the sleep. Does it put enemies to sleep or. Yeah. Oh, then probably if you're going with sleep weapons. Yeah, well, no, it is my sleep weapon. Oh, why? Oh, okay. It's a dong. It's the weapon that looks like Dongo. Yeah, yeah. Okay. They do 190 just attack and then five sleep damage. Mm hmm. Five sleep damage may not sound like a lot, but it adds up quick on Twin Blades. Yeah. I'm attacking fast. 
That's why on a sleep elemental greatsword, you'll see significantly higher numbers on that sleep damage. I'm just gonna take the chainsaws. Just say the word. Mm, hold on. All right, let's kick yeah. some ass. I want some sleep damage. I'd rather my sleep remain undamaged. Hi there, Gaston. Are you coming up here with me? Come on. Come on, baby dog. Dog's like 90 years old. Let's get Naga Kuga. Who is the one on the right? That's a great question. It I don't know the answer. Like, it can't be the monkey again, because we saw the monkey already. Yeah, we and, shocked the monkey. Yeah. We used the monkey to beat up the fox. But I don't know why we attacked the fox. I don't know why she swallowed the fly. Here's Nargakuga. I guess we're the vine. Hi, have a beetle. Absolutely punked out of the air. Yep. Oh god, his tail has a bad hitbox. Does it do poison damage? No. Nope. It's got spikies. No, oh, those are just those are just to hurt you. Okay. Alright, its wings are apparently red, though I did get white out of that shot. You know, me standing outside of your front door is an obstacle, which is meant to stand in your way. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Crafting list. First aid med plus. There we go. Forgot to do it. Uh oh. It's up to something. Oh, it did me. It's up to something! I still disagree with the terminology, it's up to something. Why is that? I don't know, I feel like it give ow, that hurts so bad. It's a sneaky, sneaky kitty. I've, I've, I've McFallen. My butter churner is Kistolan. You can't roar at me. I guess he can, oh, it's just it. not gonna do anything. Oh, it's got the red bits around the eyes. Yep. It's pissed Ow. now, okay. Did not expect that. It took out most of my health by spinning there with its with its anger spin. It's got sort of like there's a lot of lizardy dragony features on it also. Mm-hmm. It's a cat dragon. Yeah, that's definitely what they would call it in the Wasp. Mm-hmm. Which we've decided this game is. Yep, this is the Wuzzles. I'm not doing well. I'm doing quite poorly. Nargakuga is one of the fastest monsters in the series, so it's honestly probably one of the hardest just because of that. Um, I'm also, like, tarantula. Mm hmm. That I'm moving very slowly. The main thing is abuse anything that will give you iframes when it's pissed off. I'm not managing to get too many hits in, so... And it did try real hard to kill me. For polish. That's just like Kingdom Hearts, it sure is. Abuse the iframes. Basically, any game with iframes, the the, so, the solution is abuse the iframes. Mm hmm. Or circle counterclockwise. Or circle counterclockwise, or both. So there's one enemy in Elden Ring, the Crucible uh -huh. Knight. Um. 
who was created very clearly and obviously to counter the circle counterclockwise thing. Watch out! Because he has a shield that is always on his uh, on his left side. So oh, you have cool. to circle him clockwise. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't they, they actually made... change anything, but it is they, pretty funny. They made a lefty. Yeah, sort of. He still holds his sword in his right hand. Uh. Are you going to say that a game with iframes is a Kingdom Hearts like? It's true. It's very oh. true. Kingdom Hearts invented iframes. And dog roll. Yep. Well. I'm falling. Anyone Again. who thinks that Dark Souls invented the dodge roll has never played Kingdom Hearts. The real progenitor of the dodge roll. Didn't Metal Gear Solid 1 have a dodge roll? Uh, fuck, I don't know, maybe. Metal Gear Solid's in the Kingdom Hearts universe anyway. That's true. They're basically the same. Yeah, but like, no, I mean actually. Okay. Because, uh... Sora's in... Oh, in uh, Smash Brothers? Yeah, in Smash Brothers with Snake from Metal Gear Solid. Mm -hmm. And because Tetsuya... No, not Tetsuya Nomura. No, wait, yeah, Nomura. Uh, Mike has said that every piece of Kingdom Hearts, uh, every piece of Kingdom Hearts is both canon and important, then <laughs> that means that the reason that Sora's been oh, in no. canon missing for the last, like, <clears throat> two years is because he's been Smash Brothering. Mm-hmm. God damn it. Uh, All right. Here we go. Let's try this again. Roll in. Yeah, onward. My Narga in Stories 2 is called Kitty, primarily because it's very murder-focused and has the zoomies all the time. Hi, <laughs> Mox. I just died to Narga Kuga because I was, I was trying to understand um, how Sora and Solid Snake could... could uh, Coexist. Could coexist. Do you think that love can bloom? No, wait, he's 40 and Sora's like 16. <laughs> yeah, probably not great. Yeah, Besides, not Snake is Snake is canon with Otacon. They are that married. Is, that is true. Don't ship them. They are married. Mm-hmm. Alright, this is just a warm-up anyway. Nice. Yeah. I got absolutely just tanked in the face and mouth. Yeah. Me too. Ow! That was rude. The attack had already ended and it still hit me. It's slowing down though, so even for a warm-up match, this is this isn't this isn't going terribly, honestly. After it! We got a large wyvern tier. Here I was hoping it was an actual material. Let us go! Don't, don't let us go! Right, I'm... I, I really like how she says let us go instead of let's go. I got a scale. Sweet. Yeah. That means you probably now have access to the Narga Kuga set in high rank. Uh, good. Uh, oh. Me, on the other hand, I got a wyvern tier. I'm very disappointed. God, I'm glad I know the hitbox on that attack. No, that's not it. Bloody hell. I'm trying to get orange, but my I keep fucking it no, up. Stop or it. my bug does, I'm not sure which. It's targeting you! Just walk casually to the side at a at a perpendicular to the attack, and it'll miss you. It's real nice. That's only for that specific tackle though.
I panicked there because I thought it was doing the other tackle. Well, put a string on it. That's good. That holds it still briefly. Does that mean this is a strand type game? Yes. Okay, good. I mean, that makes more sense than just saying that basic um, narration uh, techniques make it a special kind of story. I, I will be very honest with you, I don't actually know what the fuck uh, Kojima thinks a strand type game means. He literally described it as uh, having various things happen and then having them come together later in the story. Yeah. That's, that's called foreshadowing. It's basic writing. Yeah. He thinks he invented authorship. Huh. Yeah. Well, that's a bummer. Mm hmm. Oh. Oh, hey. You found, uh, you found I'm, another lizard. I'm riding a lizard. And then I go, what is that? What is That's, that? What is that? What is that? Is it some kind of robot? What's a robot? <laughs> you do not know what a robot is. <laughs> And then the numbers got bigger, yes. Toby Tobies, exactly. There we go. I've smacked it. Appreciated. Impressive. Now I'm the fastest monster. Oh no, you can't hit me for shit. Ha 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 ha. Because I'm too goddamn fast. Also, Toby is tied to the ground. part of it. Sure. I guess. I mean, it's easy to hit your opponent when they literally cannot move. Yeah, but he can uh, still counterattack, and with slower monsters, that's actually a yeah. very big pain. But Nargakuga is not a slower monster. Away. As I said, one of the fastest in the game. Toby scales, Kuga fangs. No, oh, I'll wait for you to. Kuga pelts. All right. So even if we faint again, this was not a wasted trip by any stretch. Good. We have probably accessed two brand new costumes. And we have some additional materials. Ow. I meant to do that. Oof. I'm pretty sure I dodge rolled out of the way of that, but whatever game. The the iframes can be unforgiving. Their frames give it, and the eye frames take it away. Mm hmm There are skills to extend them, which with other weapons I usually take. Not with, not with the insect blade, though. Because I don't dodge roll that often with the insect blade. Ow. No, no, it broke the rock. After all... If I dodge roll, I have to touch the disgusting ground. That's true. I found some bones. Hey, cool bones. Let's have a closer look. Radical my, bones. My face went bones. <laughs> I'm just gonna follow it the way that it went. Over that hill, over dale. Ooh, ask Kirgo. Um, I went the wrong way. I got an ask Kirgo. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Drop it. 
suspect I have mentioned this before, but Nargakuga looks and moves like the Magnamar from Ark. Yeah, you mentioned that last time. I imagine Ark definitely took some inspiration from some designs from Monster Hunter. Dinosaurs. Getting high with dinosaurs. That's what I do. Yeah. I was gonna say maybe I should watch that show, but I don't know if I wanna. What the whitest kids you know? No, I was thinking of um, Doug Benson's show called Getting Doug with High. Oh, I have never seen that. Nor do I know yeah. who Doug Benson is. So Doug Benson um, is a stand-up comedian who Ooh. is a very vocal uh, medical marijuana advocate. Mm -hmm. Or was. I think he thinks he's one now. Uh, <laughs> um, but he has a show, or had a show, for a while called Getting Dug With High, where it was just like an interview program, but they hotboxed the entire studio. Mm -hmm. And then like had like chartered, chartered cabs to take people away from the studio and to wherever they are going to not be high at. Mm -hmm. Jeez, I'm having to just use my fucking uh light as dodges right now. The doctor, I am the whitest kid I know. <laughs> it takes so, a lot of editing to make a couple of high people as funny as they appear on TV is the thing. Yeah, but that's the deal, is that you can do that. Mm-hmm. When you're... When you're Doug fucking Benson. <laughs> When you're Doug Benson and you uh, made the critically acclaimed documentary Super High Me. Oh, I remember that. Yeah. Yeah, that came out after Super Size Me, which was actually bullshit. Yeah. Like, Super High Me isn't necessarily Ooh. less bullshit. Yeah, sorry. It's all good. See? It says don't sweat it there. And we can always try again. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look at what skills are on these new equipment sets. That's good to check. Because maybe we don't need to fight the Nargakuga right now. So I looked up um, how melding works in this game, and it is completely up to gambling, and I'm lucky I got any of the shit that I actually wanted. Oh. It's not a good system. Rad. Yeah, you have like a certain chance of getting the skill that you ask for, and then it randomly places other skills on the decoration, or not decoration, the uh, talisman as well. It's like, who came up with this and why did they come up with this? Let's see, forge armor. <laughs> well, apparently we already had these because I don't have anything showing up as new. Let's yeah. see what is actually on Nargakuga, though. The thing is that I don't think we opened it. Yeah, it doesn't look like we did. List. Unless it's got a different name. Okay, that's Mizutsune, that's Anjanath, Somnicanth, Ramobra. Ramobra uses some Nargakuga, but... Channeler is, Channeler is also uses no it uses a bunch of stuff. Channeler and medium. Maklava. Um Melahoa. Yeah, I guess we didn't get the right piece to get the Nargakuga stuff. I think we might just have to like beat the thing. It's usually a specific, like guaranteed piece. But yeah, maybe it's maybe it actually has to be taken down in this one. Sounds like item crafting in Path of Exile. Yes, except this doesn't have a terrible free to play model to encourage it. Um, I'm willing to give it another go. Mm. 
Okay. We'll get it this time. It'll be easy. Resby, mm -hmm. please. You're being a butt. This time I'm going to do um, the thing that I should have done in the first place and use Super Best Nut. Okay. It um, often decreases damage taken. <laughs> It's the super best nut. Um, hmm. How much extra damage does a monster take from an element it is weak to? Uh, depending on how weak it is, you can see the, uh, I believe 10 is standard, and then it'll show you what element, in, in its entry, it'll show you how much more damage it takes from being hit in a specific spot with that element. Right. And I You're... think where it's registered as three stars on the wiki, it's 35 or 40. So that's like three and a half to four times uh, total damage. So a lot. Yeah. I think I might just be better off taking the bunny dongo. Mm hmm. Like, its raw damage is just significantly better than the thunder by such an amount mm -hmm. that the thunder isn't actually, like, helping that much. How much uh, elemental damage do your, do your swords do in general? Um, not a lot. Like, the thunder blades that I have right now uh, do 10. Okay, that's not too much lower than what my insect glaive does. Raw damage yeah. is definitely a thing you can do. I, I personally like the elemental damage, but it does take a lot longer to build up a set for it. Because the way I have my set set up, I have also max level elemental damage skill, which, let me uh, order my dongo and I'll pull the exact numbers. Should I take this? This is 24 thunder damage and also 10 paralysis damage. That's pretty sweet. And its regular attack is 100. Mm hmm. Which is why I'm sort of iffy. Mm hmm. Versus like 190 and 170 for the other things I'm looking at. Mm hmm. Alright, so level 5 uh, thunder attack gives me plus 20% bonus uh, thunder damage. So that's like... I need to actually find the uh, the equipment. So... Dongo is made out of mochi. Mm-hmm. But I don't really know what mochi tastes like. There's some green tea mochi in the freezer. There is. Does it just taste like green tea? Kinda, yeah. Okay. I know Alice didn't like it, and I don't like green tea anyway. Especially not American green tea. Mm-hmm. Fuck. Um, equipment info. There it is. Okay, so I'm doing 12 thunder damage per hit. Okay. On top of that, uh, all of my damage is being increased by, I think, 50% by my insect. Mm -hmm. So that brings it up to 18. And then plus 20% of that is about 3, 4 extra damage, so I'm over 20. And then I also get plus 4, so I'm getting about 25 elemental damage per hit. So that's why my damage is so high, is because of that skill level. Right. So you have to build around it. But raw damage, if you're going for that, is probably certainly simpler. And you can also increase raw damage too. with attack boost, so. Mm. And we got some axes that do 210 damage. Sweet. What would you like to do? I'm take these. Okay. Did I eat already? Yeah, I just need to level up the thing. Actually, I should accept the quest so that you don't leave without me on the quest. There, okay. I've just put up the quest. Okay. Uh, but I need to rummage through my item box for a second. Mm -hmm. 
because <laughs> I don't have any regular potions. Mm -hmm. So mochi basically is just, it's ice cream. It's very, very sweet. Um, and it's wrapped in um, rice dough. So you get a, you get a nice uh, flash of textures. And yeah, the green tea, the two, the American green tea kind of tastes like vegetable rot. And yeah, Japanese green tea tastes like clay. Not a fan of either. But I you're more of a fan of Japanese green tea. I, if I had to pick one, I'd pick Japanese green tea. I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go, gamers. Rude. Oh, we don't Easy have a mystery time. monster this time. Easy rations. Somewhere. There they are. I am going to Mega Demon Drug. And. The Rumido. Mega Armor Skin. And also, I'm going to craft. Four first aid meds, apparently. Oh, I forgot to refill my honey. Oh well. Not a big deal. I can pick up more while we're here. Ooh, fuck you, life. I'm looking around for it. Have you found it? Um. There, watch out. There's Toby behind you. Yep. Let us dance. Found it. Uh -huh. You're much better at finding those than me. I always see lucky life, and then I look around for like 10 minutes and don't find shit. Mm -hmm. Onward into battle. I'm really good at where's Waldo, but you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. Or as we called him in Canada, where's Waldo? So, you know, when you're walking up a flight of steps, mm -hmm. and you, there's one less step than you think there is. Yep. And you like overreach to step on that step, but it's not there. So you just sort of go. Yep. That's how you just made me feel. <laughs> so uh -huh. sometimes you'd find Where's Wally books in Canada, but most of the time it was Where's Wall. Be careful! Ooh, not sure what that was. It didn't appear to give me any stink explosion or anything. Well, that's good. You didn't get the stank. No, uh, Nargakuga just does raw damage. I don't think it adds any status or anything. Yeah, I, it was a different thing that I was seeing. I had a, a green one mm -hmm. explode near me. A green one, eh? Yeah. A green bug. Huh. Um, the big green bug? Uh, the Vitali- the, the, the Vitala wasp? He, maybe the, wow, you just really want to trap me in this corner and murder my body. Yeah, I'm trying to get my juice and it's trying to prevent me from doing so, I think. Which unfortunately means staying away from me and going after you. And I just get my juice. Yeah, onward. Yeah. yeah, the big green, the big bulbous green bug heals you. Uh, the one that puts out a, a thing. The green cloud? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's what it was then, because it was a green cloud. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's that's one of the ways that I've uh, been healing you over the over the last little while. I guess mm -hmm. you assumed I was using an item when I did it. <laughs> um Uh I'm lost sometimes in this game. Uh it's just sort of stuff happening. It's all just shapes. Just shapes and beats. Ooh, speaking of beats. I got I got beat is what I'm saying. Oh. That's a shame. 
I can't believe I managed to miss both of those. Oh, I got the Ow. Okay, the the the, the defense up from the uh, armor skin is helping a lot. I'm taking less than half the damage I was before. Get ready. All over with it. No. All right. Now, got a no. full combo in. Disagreed. Decidedly not all right. I'm so sorry. Trying to pull. I have a stink mink. As soon as I get my juice, I can send it off. I think animals are fighting. Yeah, Toby's yep. over there again. Got him. Yep. Ow. Knocked me over. Didn't do any damage. Whoops. Definitely took damage that time. That was my fault, though. I'm mining. I'm being, uh... ...ripped apart by the Nerg. There we go. Help, help, I'm being oppressed. I got it. Come on! I got a pelt. Mm-hmm. And a fang. I've got a cat. I've got a fang. It is not listening to me when I tell it where to go because it is I've a cat. Got a fang. God, please just go up the fucking path. It keeps jumping over the cliff and I'm not I'm not telling it to do that, I want y'all to know. I need to get off this cat. Use it for the big smash? Yeah. Alrighty. I think I pissed it off, though. I mean, it doesn't look happy, but that's just sort of Nargakuga. Mm-hmm. Better it says Nargakuga is protecting its precious body fluids, which is true. Mm-hmm. That's just real stuff. No, I missed it. I missed it. It's the other way. Haha, yeah. <laughs> time for Nargakuga. <laughs> Ooh, my bug's attacking the very tip of its tail now. Rude. Just wandered out of the way of my spin. Just Ow. gently wandered. Uh, I mean, to I meant me to. Over, I think. Yeah. Are you going to sleep? No. No. Just staggered. Heavily staggered, though. Oh, shook it off. And zoom. And welcome to the boom. Four, two, oh, three, four. I missed the zoom. Never saw zoom? I uh, never saw zoom. No. It was a children's show on television. Mm hmm. I remember Captain Zoom. That's a movie no one seems to remember. I can't find anything about it. So what's Zoom like? Oh, it was just a show where, like, it was an hour early morning on a Saturday where it's like, hey, here's some stuff that kids sent in. Mm -hmm. Oh, now it's asleep. Oh, it sure is. And I managed to get my bug to stop attacking just in time. All I right, barrel, barrel bomb, bomb time. I do. I need a blow. I'm gonna grab this material. 
Oh, hang on. I have one more. I have one more. Excellent. Okay. All right. Tell me when. You ready? I'm, a I'm away from it. <laughs> I did not enjoy that series of events. No, I wouldn't want to be wake. Wait, I have um, exploding head syndrome. I do get woken up like that. <laughs> uh. After it! Yeah! Onward into battle! Thank you, Bad Road. Oh, I finally figured out how to remove lock-on entirely without having to scroll through all the monsters. Okay. You just hold down uh, the right stick for a couple seconds. I created a distraction. I created a distraction. So, I uh, stay away from that fish. I, I fell down a hole? Oh, well, I guess you're away from the fish, then. I am away from the fish. But I did fall down a hole. Hmm. Get run up the run up the wall. Please run up the wall. So like the Prince get, of Persia. He's like the Prince of Persia. I must ask you to let me back up this wall. Only the 3D Prince of Persia though. When when the prince is two-dimensional, he cannot run up walls. Oh, uh well, no, that's not. Uh PG2K, that's little little poison fuckers, not the big poison fucker. Well, I fell down. It's a hard place to do a fight in. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna sharpen my weapon and then run back up. Uh, oh, no, could... she's coming down to me. Fuck. Oh, fun. Uh... Okay, now she's running away. She's gonna wet my stone real She quick. came up, looked at me, then turned around and scooted off. Go! It's generally more of a loud bang than an explosion like a shelf broke. I get all kinds of different sounds. Uh, usually tied into whatever I'm anxious about at the time. Ow. We'll get alarms, explosions, or a sound like the ceiling's collapsing. Lots of fun stuff. Oh, hi. Look oh, who's here. Oh, it's Hey, ride the tiger. The eye of ride the tiger. The ride of the tiger? Damn, there's a song called Holy Diver that's about riding tigers. That's true. That's true, and there's a NES game based on it. Or a Famicom game, I should say. Oh, fuck. I slammed it into a wall by accident. Fortunately, I managed to uh, switch switch it up real quick. Oh, we can't ride Mizutsune. I thought she'd be ready. Oh. That's wild. Oh, you bought uh, Nagakuga into the wall and not Mizutsune? No, I uh, actually corrected and uh, then got Mizutsune. But it did not knock Mizutsune down, which is a first. That's a shame. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, I know. Roar. I just healed and threw out two rations, so I expect it to cover my blood. Yep, there it goes. Powder is really does way less damage or heals way less damage than it used to. I didn't know that herbal powder was still a thing. I mean, I thought that was one of the streamlines is that they just like replace it for regular potion. No, no. Uh, herbal powder is a thing that heals everyone around you. Oh, okay. Ow, okay. Ow, 
Okay, 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 that's fine. Just gotta eat a potion real quick. Damn, that was not enough. Mm-hmm. Okay, she's that's running away again. Must remain sharp. Oh, hey, it's this hippo. No, don't attack the hippo. We don't we don't talk about the one about being cheetahs, uh, bad road. We don't we don't talk about it. Never happened. It never happened. What's the new fifty two? I don't understand. <laughs> I like the idea that New 52 is the uh, Action 52 of the DC Universe. Yeah. Now, rude. I'm trying to get to that tail, but Argakuga keeps running out of the way. Yeah. Yeah, she's like that. I guess some light ne can never be seen. But mostly, she just raged. I have Holy Diver uh, on my my shelf where I keep all my very uh, real Nintendo games. Mm hmm. And I haven't played it yet. It, it just seemed like something I had to have because I really like Dio. Mm hmm. It felt like it would it would be silly for me to not have that game in my collection. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it gained a little um, attention a few years ago when some internet personality talked about it. I don't remember who it was. It doesn't matter. Yeah, and given how internet personalities go, we probably don't need to be putting people's names in our mouth. Mm-hmm. Did that get the tail? tail? It looked like it was getting the tail, but no, she was just freaking out. The spikies went away. Yeah. Does that just that, happen? Yeah, that just means she's not pissed anymore, or not as pissed anymore. Aw, oh, dang. At least I think so. Maybe they they're broken. Say the tail was cut or anything. Yeah. It didn't say parts broken anywhere. Yeah. Oh, there, there it is. Yeah, I thought so. No, you're right. It just has the spikies when it's pissed off. Yeah, that's what I thought. I, I misunderstood the purpose of the spikies. There are anger spikies. The care of eating those spikies. Mm-hmm. Remember to water your spikies once a day. I know it was the head that broke. Yep. Don't let it, go. Don't let it escape! Don't let it escape! Onward is a fast be razor sharp! There's material if you didn't oh. see it. Thank you. It was a large wyvern tier again. Is it directly above us? It's directly yeah. above us. There it is. It was out of my 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 field of view, and then it jumped into my field of view. Air, huh? mm -hmm. There we go, knocked down. Some bits came off. Yep. Oh, got me. Come 
on, give me the juice. Give me the juice I need to complete my juice collection. It's a really weird collection. Also, everyone knows that Katie is the best at juice. That's true. That's true. You got me there. We got a quote for it and everything. Mm hmm. Hey, that was mean of me. I'm sorry. It's all good. Every, every, even if Katie like has a better juice collection, that doesn't mean that I should be disparaging you and your juice collection because it brings you joy. <laughs> that's that, that's cool of me to insinuate otherwise. And I'm sorry. Well, fortunately, I've got thick skin and thick juice. <laughs> Yeah, that's what you want, that thick juice. That's right. That, it's so hard to drink. <laughs> it's it's just, just, it does not go down easy. No, it's like a Slurpee if a Slurpee was, like, liquid. It's like a milkshake, but it's orange juice. I think that's just called an orange Julius. Oh man, I haven't even thought about Orange Julius in forever. Those were gross. Yeah. <laughs> How did that become popular? Um, because it was something you drank wandering around a mall. I and guess. Guess what doesn't exist anymore? <laughs> Both Orange Juliuses and malls. Mm-hmm. Now's my chance! They were parasitical. You know, to each other. There's a Terry Pratchett book about that. Mm -hmm. it's called uh, Reaper Man, and a lot of people is that sleep? Yep. Uh, we they, don't have bombs. No, we don't. Um. Is there anything else I can do? Not really. Ah, rude! I'm trying to sharpen my fucking sword over here. I'm full up on shit, um, so just let me know when I can hit. Yeah, hit go the for monster. it. Oh wait, I can. I got a. Okay. Um, on three. Okay. One, two. Hey, hang on, come oh, for the scale. Yep. Just sec. Just sec. These fuckers are over here, um, poisoning me. Yeah. All right. One, two, three. Two juices. Juices. Come on. Get that face juice. There we go. Face juice. Made with the real all face. The all star juice of Kamala Kamala. Face juice. Which one's Stefani doing? Hanging out with face juice. <laughs> Toby Kadachi has now left the locale. We've got all new monsters now, aside from Kuga. Uh, the Nogar has just fallen directly down behind us. Oh, good. They're about to have a scrap about it. Yep. You can attack and ride Wyvern. Excellent. Let's do that. I think this being the third time we've been able to ride Narga Kuga over the course of this match. Yeah, this is more than usual, even for me. And I'm built around this shit. Alright, here pants. we go. Boom. Come on, Zenogre. Yes. Sorry, I just comboed it. That's fine. I was far away. I should take the opportunity to heal anyway. Oh, that was rude. Y'all see that? That was rude. God. Hitting one of the fastest monsters as one of the slowest monsters is actually pretty challenging. I did it though. I got there. And now you're really, really fucking it directly up. Nagakuga didn't drop any bits, huh? No, it's out of bits because we've ridden it three times. Right, that makes sense. 
turns out that bits are limited. Probably almost ready for capture now. You'd think, but it's not up. Well, it takes a second after it actually gets to the point because uh, it needs. We need to get to a point where we're registering it. To keep knocking it down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it wasn't knocking down at all at first, and now it is just constantly. All right, thank you for 200 Honk. bits, Clem. Hong Kong. <laughs> Eat this steak right in the middle of a fight. That's a good. Is that a well done steak? That's what. Nah, just rations. That's oh, how okay. people in Oklahoma do things. We eat a just steak while in the middle of a fight. Uh, I've lived here almost my entire life, and that is true. <laughs> That's just a real thing. Mm hmm. You know, fights in Oklahoma can go on a while. Mm hmm. Because no one wants to, like, admit that they're wrong even a little bit. Yep. Hey, there's. All right. That took way too long. Way too motherfucking long. Oh, you're heading right for me. Not today, Cooper. Not I'm gonna pull aggro. No, it decided to run away instead of aggroing me. Uh. I shall put this to good use. Let us go! Must remain. I carved the tail, and I was like, this will definitely pull aggro. And it I usually mean, does. Yeah, it would have. If, you know, it wasn't already running away. Yeah. <laughs> You ever think about Goldeen? The fish? You ever think about the fish Goldeen from Pokemon? Occasionally. It's wild, huh? Yeah, it wears lipstick and everything. It's like people think that, um... People think that the trend of, like, unnecessarily sexy Pokemon is a, is a new aberration, but... <laughs> <laughs> but Goldeen. It's not. They've been trying to get me to fuck Goldeen for years. It's true. I mean, she doesn't even do anything in Smash Bros. except show off her entire body. Yeah. Just on the floor writhing like that. It's very sexual. <laughs> Is this an okay joke to make? I have no idea. Okay, cool. I, don't, I always felt weird to me that Goldeen just used Splash in Smash Bros instead of Magikarp. And I remember uh -huh. reading the reason for it. But I cannot remember what it was for the life of me. Was it because you could kick, theoretically, Magikarp and it would turn into Gyarados? Maybe. But that would have been kind of fun. There was a chance for a, the useless Pokemon to turn into a horrible dragon. Like, that's the whole point of Magikarp. Mm hmm. Which I think is based on a piece of Japanese folklore that I'm not particularly familiar with. Yeah, basically, that if this type of carp could uh, climb a waterfall, it would turn into a dragon. Ah, fuck. I should have rolled. Alright, got my orange juice. Got my orange Julius. My thick orange juice. That is the image macro I see of Magikarp. Is the when I evolve, I'm going to kill you all. Mm hmm. All right, flinch. I much prefer the one where it's just like magic carp but strong. Mm hmm. Where you put a whole buff human body underneath magic carp. Mm hmm. Like, no, I can be strong right now. 
That's very self-actualizing. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's a distraction fish over there. Oh, look, a distraction fish. You know, speaking of magic art. Need to stop doing that. Oh, she's ready for capture now. Oh, good. I'm about to be hit. <laughs> I might be knocked out. Yep. Don't give up yet. Don't give up yet. Because I'm just gonna capture. Good, thank you. There's an outcropping over here where I'm standing. Uh, I'm coming. Thank you. Uh huh. Dragonite, like the Pokemon. Then, as if Magikarp weren't cumbersome enough, they introduced Freebase and Milotonic. I don't know these new Pokemans. Uh, apparently, they're drug references. Uh, that's not what they're called. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Good. Right. Oh, hey, I got a shiny thing. Sweet. It's a Wyvern gem. Sweet. So that was much easier. Just had I, to just had to warm up. I don't know if I would call it easier, but we did win. We won without a single death. That's true. All right. I've been waiting I did see that Pokemon was adding a stoner cat. <laughs> Didn't it already have Meowth? Alolan Meowth does know where the weed is. Mm-hmm. Is the thing. But meanwhile, the mainland Meowth is the one who's gonna sell it to you. What would you like to do? Alright, what do we got next? Ever tell that story about like being on a, a road trip? And a dude accosted me. Mm. It didn't accost me so much. But, like, I was just... We'd stopped in at a... Like, a gas station on the freeway. Mm-hmm. To, like, pick up snacks and dude... Uh, pick up snacks and stuff. And this dude came up to me and said, Hey, uh... You know where the weed's at? <laughs> this was a period of time where... Uh, like, what I was wearing was... Like some jeans, a uh, like black t-shirt, a uh, red plaid dress jacket, mm -hmm. and sunglasses indoors at night. Mm -hmm. So I was like, I understand why you're asking me this question, <laughs> but I don't <laughs> smoke weed and I'm on a road trip. I'm not from around here. <laughs> Lovely. I actually had enough stuff to make a Kadachi Glaive uh, upgrade. Ooh. Oh, Nagakuga does have a bunch of critical eye, but I can't make anything except the the torse. Mm. Which is good. The torse is the uh, least good part of my current setup. Mm hmm. Looking at Zenogre, you'd think it would have a, a higher critical affinity. Banabra. Banabra da 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 da. <laughs> that also. There it is. Uh, I do need to fight Gosharag to upgrade my death port staff. Mm -hmm. And... Several others. Several other things. Uh, I need to fight Mizutsune to upgrade my fox halberd. I really like the... Uh, 
the Somnicanth weapon. It's got a hand on the end of it. Oh, huh. That's sort of upsetting. You know where the weed's at? Not in this city. I'm doing this whole thing with my friend. Um, they're going to trick me into pissing on a statue of a deer. <laughs> you know, I'm not going to ask how you get tricked into pissing on something. Oh, uh, well, um... Compiling, uh, <laughs> the, the, without going into details, because those aren't my details to share, we, we were spending, like, the weekend in an RV. Mm hmm Or not an RV, a mobile home. Mm hmm Um, but one that was, like, in a mobile home, like, place where mobile homes are. Yeah, an RV park. E not quite that. It was uh, like I've been in RV parks before, and they're quite close together, like little neighborhoods. This there, there was a lot more space in between uh, each of the things, and uh, this had a lake just in the within walking distance. Mm -hmm. Oh, not so very the troll. Far away. Sorry, Clem says so. The troll will let you pass. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, continue. Um. So my first night there, I'm like, uh, I gotta. Key, where is the bathroom at? And my friend looks at me and says, It's an RV, uh, Christy. That's there's not a bathroom in here. <laughs> so, like, what do I what do? I do? I yeah, just go out to the lake. We just go out to the lake and pee in the lake. <laughs> and I went outside and I looked at the lake, which was like 200 steps away. Mm -hmm. I was like, my need to pee is too great to walk that distance, so I went behind a storage shed next to the mobile home mm -hmm. where someone had stored a deer behind it, a plastic deer statue. Mm -hmm. And so I just peed while being stared at by this plastic deer. <laughs> It's Toby time! Is it Toby time? Uh, should we take a break before it's Toby time? Uh, if you'd like. I think I would like. I need to refresh some things. Okay. Alright, water damage. Plus it, uh, cast thunder, obvious. Alright, so. There are ways that you can help. The ongoing civil rights movement, which has been happening for decades now, whether the media is covering it or not. Black Americans, people of color, are struggling for equal rights, equal opportunities, and equal treatment under the law. We suggest the Bail Fund Network to help keep protesters out of jail, the Okra Project and the Black Trans Travel Fund to help black trans and non-binary people with food, supplies, and travel out of dangerous situations, and the Black Hills Legal Fund, the Lakota People's Fund to take back their land, the Six Grandfathers, which was stolen by white people, renamed to Mount Rushmore arbitrarily, and then had white people, white slave owners' faces carved into the side of it. Under this second command are more current campaigns. This is kept up to date by Christy here. And if you know anything else that needs to go here, please let her know. These are great starting places. Know that you can find more ways you can help via your favorite search engine. You can duck, duck, go at it. You can... Alta Vista. I don't think that exists anymore. Anyway. Black lives matter, the lives of people of color matter, indigenous lives and lands matter, Asian and Pacific Islander lives matter, and these are things we need to keep saying and pushing and fighting for until the people all the way to the top not only understand and acknowledge them, but work to make them real protected truths. All right, we're gonna take a quick break. We'll run some ads. We have no stance on ad blockers. 
get a drink or something. We'll see you back here soon. So anyway, I'm back. Christy's, Christy's gonna be another minute. I've got Toby Kadachi set up and ready to go. Oh, well, I am going to very quickly eat some lightning dung. Some thunder resist, fighter, and hell, let's go with defender again. Let's do a motley mix. There we go. I sure was. Ah, good. The only song on uh, Mouth Dreams that won't get us copyright stream. All oh, right, is Yahoo. Yep. <laughs> Happy Cat, the next generation. Uh, all right, what is that? Water is the weakness, I believe. Like 95% sure. I'm pretty yeah. sure that's what you said. Water, fire, and ice, but weaker to water than anything else. Water, fire, and ice? Yep. Uh, bugs that suck, I guess. Mm hmm. I have pretty good water weapons. Sweet. The, uh, it makes up for it by being immune to thunder and resistant to dragon. Ah, okay. Cannot upgrade my fox glaive yet, but that's okay. Ready to go? Yeah, uh, no, no, wait, sorry. I just realized I made this new piece of armor and I forgot to upgrade it. Ah, uh, that's important. Yeah, that's sort of, that's sort of a thing. I give you so many armor spheres in here. You used to have to grind for those things. World, World was the grindiest of the series. This game has cut down on it a lot. Alright, I'm ready now. Alright. For real this time. Alright. Pizza time! X-Men, welcome to die! Just got arcade sounds stuck in my head. Can we not get away with, um, Amore? I doubt it. That's almost, like, as far as a bot's concerned, it's pretty much identical to the original. Right, but the original's ancient. Not ancient enough to, to be out of copyright. Yeah, you're right. Are we after Toby? I almost went after Zenogre. Uh, no, this is fine, what I'm doing. I'm correct. Honey! Funny, I blew up the Zenogre. Exactly. There's so much Zenogre. Oh, bones. Good. Yeah, and there's an outcropping over here, too. Sweet. In case you need Carbolite Ore, or Dragonite Ore. Or Light Crystals. Or Light ah, Crystals. fucking jerk ass. Just puked on me. Oh, that sucks. Is this the right thing? 
the uh not this one but the one past it okay what's useful let us dance this lizard yep what's up toby we missed you out i just got bonked by that roar okay that was rude oh did you get chased by yeah I want to say Zen Ogre. Uh, Rathian. The Rathian. But no, um, it just managed to Thunder Blight me after stunning me. Ow. Okay, that's fine. I'm fine. Just want the juice. Getting that first so, juice is the hardest part. So Rathian has decided. Yeah, she kind of wandered over, huh? Yeah. You go ahead and take it. Okay. Oh, I thought she was running away right away for a second there. That'd be mean. Knocked me out of the air. Air much better. I'm a flying squirrel. Yeah, people forget that part. The flying squirrels had sharp pointies. What masterful skill! Whoops. I was trying to pick up items. No, I'm fine letting you do that. Okay. Or anything, so. Okay. Rathian, 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 Toby Kadachi, Toby Kadachi, da 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 Apparently the answer is somewhere. I know it's in there somewhere. 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 As I got free. Wait, that's something different. A tie from time constraints. Is there a reason not to kill or capture monsters other than the ones you were specifically hunting? Um, time constraints is the reason, yeah. Yeah. Uh, like, we could absolutely capture the Rathian. Mm hmm. But it would take, like, we have a limited amount of time in the field. And these fights already take quite a long time. Mm -hmm. So, trying to split your, um, trying to split your attention between two, like, unless you have a real, like, hunt mass squad of four. Uh, probably. God, let me out. She just whacked you with her tail and then ran away. Oh, I hate that. If I could have survived exactly one more hit, it would have been fine. Mm-hmm. No, that's a nullberry. Don't. Okay. I'm doing drugs. I couldn't be the best monster hunter if I smoked marijuana. Is there a name for the continent we're on? I don't think so. Um, is that... Yeah. Well, where Toby Kavapi is? Uh, yes. Okay. Oh, let's see. Ooh, I got a tri-point pitcher plant. 
Is that one of the carry ones? Nope. Just, uh, uh, just an item I hadn't turned in yet. Gonna wall run over here. Asia. Hmm. I know you're out there somewhere. I think it's Asia, the band. Asia. Oh, might be. Where the fuck is she? Oh, there she is. Literally right behind me. She is right behind me, isn't she? <laughs> Heard me talking shit. Okay, so I think front legs get me the white, which is much easier when she's got her wings spread. Wow. Yeah, there oh, we go. Damn. Yeah, she's she hits pretty hard in this game. Yeah, and she's really after me because the water weapons are doing very good. Mm-hmm. I'm doing like 24 a hit. There we go. Let's knock her the fuck down. Predictable hitboxes. I love predictable hitboxes. After it! <laughs> you know, if you uh, click your heels together three times while you say that, uh, Beetlejuice will appear. I, I was gonna say Hidetake Miyazaki will appear directly in front of you, and you can kick him in the balls. <laughs> I just tried to dismount um, buckles by tapping L3. That's not it. No. L3? Yeah, left joystick. Oh. Hey, get off torrent. Uh. I get off for it by hitting um, Y and down. Ah, okay. That's how I get on Torrent. But uh, I get off of her by, uh, clicking, L3. by uh, clicking L3. Oh, uh, there's monster fight. Sweet. Monster, monster fight have happened. If Hello, wanna... Zenoga. Long wanna... time no see. Thought you could replace me, did you? What? <laughs> what is this lore? <laughs> There's that really good. Oh god. Um, OZD sketch. Mm hmm. Where it's like the one of his RPG sketches where there's like oh. a character that you I got bonked like, off get introduced to early mm -hmm. and don't use because the other characters are better mm -hmm. then when you get to you just sort of skip through the all the dialogue and it's like no I have a reason to be here the, the final boss is like my brother oh yeah I think I actually have some dialogue for this part <laughs> Yeah, skip it. Skip it, skip it, skip it. Uh, she's fighting with Rathian again. Oh god, they're all three in the same place. My name's Chad Bradson. My sword is a gun. Oh, oh, Rathian's been knocked down. More riding. I'm on it, literally. Oh. I got 
Oh, the writing. You're all over it. Oh, it is very difficult to try and take on two of them. There we go. I can blow fire, so it's fine. I'm just sort of watching this clusterfuck happen from, mm -hmm. from the back nine um, while I heal up, and it's something. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I guess Toby's leaving. Zenogre's also taking a powder. <laughs> Rathian's just sticking around, huh? No, no, Rathian, there's some stuff by your feet. I just need to... No, I just need to get this garbage out. Okay, well... Do, do you need me to come back? Uh... No. Okay. Two plus. Grab another turkey and put it by your feet. Thank oh, you, Bad Road. No, oh, she's pissed off at me again. Gaston, hey. please chill. Hey, 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 sounds like my ex-wife. You know what I mean? <laughs> Gaston, you're being a butt. Pick the bones. Rathian came back down. Yep. Wow, they are just. They are aggressively uh, fighting each other. They are just coming at one another. Is Rathian like, leaving already? Yep. How? Okay, sure. It's like Steen and Generico, these two. Rude. I, I hope El Generico is doing okay. <clears throat> no one knows who he is. No one knows who he is, but we know that he is taking care of orphans in a orphanage in Mexico. <laughs> That's what he retired to go do. Mm -hmm. So he did things in the reverse order of uh, of the Padre. Yeah. The Padre. Who started out taking care of orphanages and then started wrestling ow, to ow, take oh, care crap, oh, to crap. take care of the orphans better. And now every RPG has to make a reference to him. Yep. Oof. And also Jack Black had to make a movie about. Him, yep. Which was which fine. Was it was not a terrible movie. God damn. When she gets pissed, she gets pissed. And let me okay, tell you, she's getting pissed. My dog muzzled me out of it. Um, I would love to get in some damage without being killed in one hit. Ah, that's a good one. Not being killed in one hit. I would like it a lot if that Never have I case. heard such a thing. Listen to this lady. She's some kind of comedian. Thank you. I am some kind of comedian. <laughs> what, what kind remains to be seen, but I'm certainly some kind of comedian. Ow. I said good camera. Admittedly, I kind of leaned into the bad camera there. Did you see the new Bandai Nampai logo? Yeah, it's really hideous. I like it. You're allowed. Okay. <laughs> like, it's supposed to look like neon at an arcade, which, you know, is what Namco owns all the arcades now, basically. Mm-hmm. 
Huh? Yeah, there's a whole game about it. There's a whole game about it. We, uh, Katie and I played it on stream. Mm hmm. And we're sort of looking at uh, playing the new one when it comes out because there's a new one coming out. Mm hmm. Rude. Just let me get more juice, please. Come on. I'm down. Get down here. Oh my god. Take a flying squirrel and be a grounded squirrel instead. Brown squirrel! Oh my god, she keeps fucking throwing electrical things at me and I keep tripping on them. I think I got the tail. No, I just said parts broke. Uh, the tail doesn't lop off on Toby. Oh, okay. Spikes just... Broken it. Spikes break. Yeah, I don't think... Yeah, it's broken. Had to get a good look at it. Toby has no ham. Toby has no ham. Ah, didn't have my third juice. Oh, 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 she's trying to get away. How's that going for you? Even in the last moments of my life, I would uh, receive one uh, pure moment of eternal cosmic bliss. So, you know, I got that going for me, which is nice. <laughs> Incoming! Ooh, just got out of the way of that. <laughs> Down. Hell yeah. Does this thing uh, stop being pissed at us at any point? Between it's... like the start of the fight now? Yeah. She does stay pissed much longer than a lot of other monsters though. Regardless, she's stopped now. And really isn't that what matters. I guess, when you put it that way, it does seem silly to not count my my whole blessings. Toby Kodachi, live for the moment. A Johnson and family. After it! Get away. <laughs> it pisses me off that they renamed their company to the, the their corporation to Family. Mm. So they could put a family company on all of their, like, shit. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's so it's so fucking sketchy. It really is. Okay. She opened her mouth and I bumped into her side and that hurt me for some reason. So that's fun. Bishonen has appeared. Oh yeah, you're right. He's gonna be slightly standoffish, but uh deep down he's a big softy. You worry, he's gonna have hair. <laughs> so much hair, and this it'll boy, be so spiky. This boy's got hair. Oh, back legs are also white juice. Oh, just both the legs. They're all four, I guess. They're four legs. All of the legs. No, I just want the orange. Having so much trouble collecting all three juices on this one. Ooh, that was a good flinch. And then she got me to flinch, so I guess Ooh. it evens out. Ooh, 
big stretch. Big stretches. Oh, it's bad you guys again. Give. Oh, you guys give red. That's not help. Try not get hip checked by this little lizard. There's my orange. Just got to get the bug to uh, land somewhere near it and then just keep hitting it until it manages to tap orange. Good job. I get those juice commercials. Yep. Your character said, wah. Oh, it's ready to be captured. Excellent. Uh, let me throw down a trap of some description. Okay. Uh, it's coming. It's right for me. Here. Oh. 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 Did I get it? Yep. All right. Hey. I thought she'd walked too far for a sec. There's a... Why is it called a trick toad? I guess it's got legs. I thought it was a fish. Oh no, I guess it's a toad. That's the trick. Yeah, good job, buddy. That's the trick it. Yeah, it makes you think it's a fish, but really it's a toad. Ah, oh, I understand now. And that makes the monsters very angry. Yeah. Because they uh, can't understand it when something is slightly different from the way that they think it should be. <laughs> I can't stand it, Charlie Brown. Oh. Hello. Well, what was that thing we just killed? Toby Kadachi. Toby Kadachi. Let's see what Toby Kadachi is. Hello there. Looking for something new or an upgrade? All right, Nargakuga. I'm now looking at Nargakuga. Evade mm -hmm. window, critical eye, evade extender, evade window, evade extender. So that's just a lot of really good twin blade stuff. Yeah. I was wearing the whole Nargakuga set on the previous tier. Mm hmm. And Toby has Jumpmaster. That's a good start. Oh, right, that's why I was wearing that silly hat the whole time on the previous tier was for Jump Master. Constitution, Critical Eye, Mind's Eye. What is Mind's Eye? Your attacks are deflected less and deal more damage to hard targets. Okay, that's cool. Yes, and if you're going to come up, come up. Don't just stand there. And it has three levels of it, too. Mm -hmm. Pretty much three levels gives 100% chance of your attacks not being deflected. Plus an additional 30% damage to hard targets when activated, which is 100% of the time. Um, I need to run to the bathroom. I will be okay. right back. I'll be entertaining, presumably. Uh, so what's up? See you again soon. It's, uh, it's just, oh, I was going to say it's just you, me, and Smithy, but you backed out of the Smithy. Out of the Smithy window. I've been thinking about irons. Uh, I had learned the other day that Hollow Live VTubers called Bathroom Breaks Idol Meetings. That's fun. Because, of course, you don't want to, if you're a Hollow Live VTuber, you don't want to give the impression that your... your adorable anime girl avatar does a piss. 
that's either not what the the viewer wants to hear or it's explicitly what the viewer wants to hear so either way you're best off withholding that information That might have sounded shamey. Like, be be into piss or don't. I can't stop you, nor nor do I really care to. Just don't make it someone else's problem. Is the thing. I got these nail files. Um, you were thinking about iron? I don't even remember what I was about to say. I, do, I just started putting words together. I was glad for the uh, interruption. I got these nail files from, uh, I got glass nail files. And I like them a lot. Uh, it's actually been a while since I've kept my nails in anything but, like, explicitly trimmed, like, down to the quick because I type all day and if my nails get too long then it becomes difficult to do that um but i started letting them grow out a little bit and i'd kind of forgotten how much i like the um the the ritual of filing my nails down just like that you know that shot that's in every like shitty office thing where the girl sitting at the reception desk just sort of idly filing her nails while ignoring her job. That's me now. I get to ignore my job while I'm filing my nails at work. And the glass files I got are quite good. Uh, they don't... I've tried a whole bunch of different files and they're... They, I don't know, of course your mileage may vary, but I find that like ones that are cheap just straight don't work or fall apart instantly because they're made of like pasteboard or there's like the step up from that that feel like sandpaper because it's basically just sandpaper on a rounded edge. Uh. But these are great. They're really, they're really fine is the thing. Like you, if you're just sort of running your hands over it, it's sort of difficult to tell it's a file. But it absolutely works because it's, you know, glass. It can be like micro abraded like that. The only like downside of it is that it leaves a lot more just like debris than other files have had. Like if I just round off a finger and then I'll like pull the file back and my finger will be entirely covered in nail dust but I can always wash my hands more than that I should always wash my hands because we live in the year 2022 and everybody should be washing their hands all the time excuse me I'm about to cough into my mic why it's important to wash your hands. Don't be like me. Don't sleep with your uh, window open in the middle of a rainstorm because you like the sound. Don't, don't get sick like this. Get sick in ways that are better and more interesting. I've never really filed my nails. I keep them so short I'd be filing my fingertips. Yeah, that's where I used to be. Because the thing is, when you, like, use your hands to do work a lot, there's always the, like, if they're even a little bit beyond, like, the, the plane of the fingertip, there's that, that fear that it's just going to shatter and, like, take off half the nail with it.
We got a tin roof and the rain sounds fantastic on it. Ah, oh, that sounds nice. I, uh, theoretically, excuse me, I'm about to, uh, cough again. Theoretically, I have this playlist of, like, piano jazz plus rain sounds, which is sort of my favorite genre of thing to fall asleep to. <clears throat> the issue with it is that a lot of these... A lot of these, uh, they're not playlists, they're just like one solid eight hour block of a video. And a lot of them don't curate for eight hours. They'll like get an hour's worth of music and loop it eight times. Which is fine, I understand why you're doing that if you're a producer of videos. Um, My problem with it is that I will wake up and because my brain is bad, I want to make, I, I want you to understand this is me and my brain. It's not the fault of the video maker. Uh, I will be afraid that I am stuck in a time loop because I've been hearing the same like six bars of music over and over again every couple of hours and it sort of becomes a, a self-fulfilling thing wherever that bar of music comes up i wake up just to hear it it's very it's 20 oh what's the name of that movie it's a number and i fuck it up literally every time the one with john cusack based on a stephen king short story i want to say 2108 it's the name of the hotel room he's staying in everyone's brain is bad just in different ways that's fair That's a really good movie, is 2108, if indeed that's what it's called. I don't do a lot of, uh, I don't do a lot of horror stuff for, again, the bad brain reasons, but, uh, this was a quite, uh, good and effective horror movie for most of it. Uh, and you can tell because I'm still sort of low-key terrified of it, like, six years on from having actually watched it. I was going to say Groundhog Day, but that's not a number or a Stephen King story, as far as I know. It's not unlike a Groundhog Day, except it's, um... Like, six hours as opposed to 24, and also John Cusack as opposed to Bill Murray, and a horror as opposed to a comedy. I'm just now thinking back on it, because it has been a while since I've really thought about the movie 2108. It's mostly John Cusack. Like, it's basically John Cusack acting against... Acting, like, by himself in a room for the majority of that film's runtime. And it's... It's excellent. I like John Cusack, but until I saw that movie, I wasn't aware that he was capable of turning in that good a performance all on his own. All right, I'm back. Hello. How you doing? We were talking about the film Groundhog Day. Oh, I thought you were talking about 2108. Mm, nah, I'm pretty sure Groundhog Day. Oh, I guess we better start over then. Yeah. But, um, tss. All right, what can we punch now? I've been waiting for you. Um, I need to come back over the week and, like, blast a couple of Nargakugas just to, like, get my stuff. Mm hmm Get my gear right. Maybe we could do Anjanath, Baryoth, uh, Somnicanth, War is over. Or we could do, um, Zenogre, Anjanath, and, uh, What's all her face? <laughs> all at once. Mizutsune. Um, those are easier when it's three of them, right? No. Oh. Uh, basically, we need to finish off all of these different monsters so that we can see the next level on our weapons. 
and also see the high-end HR armor. Um, I don't know. I'm I'm fine with any of these, I guess. I didn't uh, look and see what weapons I unlocked, and I should probably do that. Okay. Let's do Anjanath. We haven't done Anjanath in a bit. Okay. Back to work. Unlike gonna... in Monster Hunter World, where you do Anjanath like 40 times during the story. I'm gonna grab that quest, but then I am going to look at my weapons. Hmm. Three star water weakness. It's fire. So I think there absolutely is room for a horror movie inside Groundhog that Groundhog Day narrative space. Mm hmm. Oh fuck. I just accidentally started the quest. I literally just picked up the controller and I bumped the right trigger and then my thumb bumped the uh, A button. How? It should have told you that I wasn't ready. Well, yeah, it it did. Oh, and then you said. But I hit the A button after I picked it up. Uh -huh. uh, abandon quest. Abandon quest. Yeah. Ooh, I can make new fire weapons that I'm not going to use. So both streams so far tonight, no drop frames. That's good. Yeah, maybe it's maybe I I don't even want to say it. Yep. You shouldn't, honestly. <laughs> oh, I can make my second tier of dragon equipment. Sweet. I really I need to that. fight Mizutsune again before I do too much with water, but this will work for now. Anjanath isn't too tough. Anjanath's predictable, that's the main thing. She's got a fairly limited moveset. Oh, I'm running out of null berries, apparently. Um, what is Anjanath? Fire. Doesn't like fire? Oh, weak to water. Weak to water. Okay, then I can keep these uh, weapons that I have currently. Hmm. Oh, hey! The uh, power charm and the armor charm are available in the shop now. Good. You just keep them in your inventory and they automatically raise your attack and defense at all times. Highly recommended. That might be why... Um, things feel like they're taking longer than they should. You guys expect us to have this equipment? Yep. You okay? I'm really clearing them out. Mm hmm. Uh, oh, whoops. He didn't, you know, actually. Yeah, eat a meal. There's the armor charm. Where did the, uh... Where did the other one go? It's fine, I'll just... Back to work. Forgot what the, uh... Sorting it's button like is. It's like that time my parents were at a baseball game and mom turns to my dad and says he's working on a no-hitter. Presumably, the next sound is the crack of the bat. What? I'm confused. That's what happens. You don't you don't say that someone's working on a no hitter. Oh, gotcha. I've got a bit of a headache, so I'm a little slow on the uptake. Yeah. Uh, in reference to the frame drops, because yeah, I got it now. Yeah, yeah. Where are those things? In the uh, shop. The guild shop. Yeah. And they'll be on the last page. And Ooh. yes, they are worth getting. Ooh, I don't have that much money. Oh, well, shit. Let me sell a whole bunch of things. Um, hmm. I need a paw print stamp. That's just regular stuff. Did the fucking thing again. 
God, I have so much crap and I don't know what the vast majority of it does. Can I just get rid of all this crap? Scrap is for Palico equipment. So yes. Probably. If you if you're not going for Palico equipment, you may have some eggs. I do have good eggs. Are eggs just sellable? Yeah. Okay. You'll know what they say, fetch is a good price. Anything that says that is just for selling. I'll buy it at a high price. I think that still might not be enough. Um, no, that's more than enough, actually. This doesn't have the option to sell all collection items. That's a shame. World had that, and it was very nice. I really wish that it would automatically move items that I wasn't using into my bag. Mm -hmm. Or into my box. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't need to carry around the Toby Kodachi pelts. That's why I have item loadouts. You set it up and then you can just fill your bag exactly as intended. I should go to the um, to the boat and tell them to start collecting Nullberries. I have no idea what they're collecting right now. Oh, okay. I'm gonna accept the quest and ready myself. The okay. quest is not there. The quest isn't there. Oh, right. Because I had to uh, abandon quest. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'm actually just gonna go over to the buddy shop also because I think I have meow scenarios that can be recalled mm -hmm. it's a buddy plaza it's not a buddy shop you don't buy them they're your partners it's not dog fighting you're hiring them hey The Argosy, there we are. Take all these lovely items. Oh good, I wanted popfish, but I can't remember why. It was for some equipment piece. No, I think it was for an item. Oh. Like a usable item. Mm-hmm. No berry. Send Mimi. And Ready. One ogre. Send one ogre after. I'm starting to. Great flame, great, great flame fin. Oh yeah. There's the stuff. Uh, yeah, I guess Thunderbugs, because I'm running a little low on Thunderbugs. Bloody bargaining. Speed bargain. Nogur, speed bargain. Flagging apple. Confirm. There we go. Now we move back to the get. Well, let's go to the gathering hub entrance to pick up my my meal ticket. Later. Not sure if it was immediate, but it was later that inning. <laughs> I said how much I really like Rondine. Uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, and an M. There. Now we're ready. Okay. Like, like Spangle Bam Squirrel Pants. Um, readied. Wait, I have water weapons? That's right, right? Yes. Okay. Fire resistance. Stamina saving and... Let's see, there's not too many things to crack my my stick off of. Oh, let's go with Ryder. I would probably like 
sports night less if I watched it now. Mm hmm. I think that goes for most shows from the 90s. Yeah. It's one of those things where I'm running it through in my head, mm -hmm. and I can't remember there being anything terrible or inappropriate. But... You don't remember the shitty stuff, that's the thing. Yeah, exactly. You don't remember the shitty stuff. I forgot what the hell we were even fighting. Anjanath. Oh, who are you? How did all you people get in my house? This isn't my house? Um, no, that's your house. It's in fact hey, more your I house got a than it is mine. I got a fella crow twig. Hey, you got there. And that you were here first. <laughs> it was just sitting there by the lake in plain view. No, the house. Oh, okay. I thought you meant I got the fella crow. I mean, you did get the fella crow, and I am happy that you got the fella crow. Excuse me. Yeah, onward. Just collecting bugs and birds and bug birds. Hashtag just bird or bug things. Just bug bird things. Oh, we can go up. Oh, I got stuck on these twigs while uh, attempting to drink my drugs. There's Somnicanth. Yeah, Anjanath is further over. At, what is that, 15? 11. It's mm -hmm. 11. Numbers, man, how do they even work? And I don't want to talk to no scientist. No number scientist. I feel like most scientists are number scientists. To an extent, definitely. Oh, it's going. It's moving. It sure is. I guess we better hurry. Nah, it stopped. You gonna miss your ride. You better hurry. Just, just yelled at me. Come on, I'm, I'm doing my best here. I just got straight pooped out of the air. Predictable hitboxes. They're good game design. Excuse me. Hello, hello there. Predictable hitboxes. Hi, I'm Hidetaka Miyazaki. And I resent predictable hitboxes. They killed my family. <laughs> You see, my family was fighting, and then someone was able to predict their hitboxes. And so they died. And they all died. Fortunately, I was saved by a poison swamp. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I've, I've been murdered by the, by the dinosaurs. The yeah, thing. I saw. Oh, Anjanath. Anjanath can be scary. I was too busy uh, congratulating myself internally for my very good joke about poison swamps. <laughs> it's okay, Miyazaki does the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> We've got, I don't know, seven poison swamps in here? I have Is run it... into at least 15 or 16. Mm -hmm. There are so goddamn many poison swamps in that game. Like, it is ludicrous. And I think that is specifically because um, the, the main player base hates them. Uh-huh. The problem is everyone hates them. <laughs> They're actually not as bad in Elden Ring. For one thing, poison isn't as bad. There are usually ways through them to, that allow you to avoid any risk of, uh, being, of uh, being poisoned by them. 
Uh huh. And uh, you can ride your horse through them, and that keeps well most of them. You can ride your horse through a lot of them, which prevents you from taking any poison uh, buildup. Uh, Kezu's coming, by the way. Ah, figures. I would really like it if we could pull some pieces off Kezu. Well, looks like that might happen. Hi, I'm Kizu. Welcome to Super Mario Sunshine. Hello, I'm Kizu. I <laughs> killed my entire family. <laughs> also, my neck gets real long. Long, long man. There was the... If you've never gone and watched the Long Long Man commercials, mm -hmm. if you just type Long Long Man commercials into Google or into YouTube, you'll find it. Yep, and it is so good. It's a very good ad campaign for a Japanese candy. Um, but you can find it all, like, translated. And the slogan is the important part. And that's yeah, in English. A, there's a song where they go long, long man, because the man is long. And then I found long, long man in Elden Ring, and it was good. There's a couple long men. The, the, I, Izu the is literally... About. Okay. Izu is literally a chicken with its head cut off. I never thought of that. Oh, it is, isn't it? Uh-huh. That's wild as shit. That would explain why it runs around, huh? Building, building. Oh, shit. Hang on. Hang on. No, which way? Which way is it? Which one am I? Am I blue? You are... Yes. You're blue on my screen. I okay. assume you're blue on your screen. Yes, I am. Alright, I'm me? coming after you, too. Um, I just well, had to get some carbolite. I missed my jump, and then Ajanath picked me out of the air. Aww. It's, it's my fault. I sort of came at Anjanath with a flying nothing, and that's not really how you get ahead in the business. <laughs> that's called uh, showing your back. I got so many people mad at me uh, when I was regularly watching UFC. Because you used wrestling terms? Not just that, but like... Um, it, I remember really specifically uh, Ronda Rousey, mm -hmm. uh, who I dislike as a person. That's because um, she's awful. Because she's awful, yes. Um, was UFC women's weight class champion. They have mm -hmm. more than one. They have more than one. Uh, but she was like... She was defending her title, but she was like she needed to leave to go film the shitty version of Roadhouse that she was in. Mm -hmm. And so she lost that match, obviously. Yeah. And almost it was, like it's pro wrestling. Almost like it's pro wrestling. And the finish of the match was, like, pretty obvious. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, that was... That was deeply scripted. Uh huh. And like everyone around me was like, no, you're wrong and stop it. It's like, I watch a lot of wrestling. I know what giving up your back for a spot looks like, mm -hmm. and it looks exactly like that. <laughs> now, like UFC is what they. UFC, uh, MMA in general, came became popular because. Um, kayfabe was revealed publicly in the WWE. So we yeah. can actually thank CM Punk for making MMA a thing. But it goes, it appeals to the same audience that watched WWE because they thought it was real fighting. Uh huh. And now they watch MMA and UFC because they think it's real fighting. Or esports. Or esports, yes, because they think that is real esports. Man, talk about a nothing, huh? They, they want to watch a competition, but real competition isn't exciting enough for television. Yeah. 
Exactly. If you want real fighting, just watch Hood Slam. Exactly. That's real. Yeah. Watching real fighting isn't interesting. There's this video that was... I'm sure I've talked about this video on stream before. Uh, mm -hmm. But there's this video that was... I say it was shot as though it wasn't someone holding up a camera phone. Mm -hmm. uh, at a, a gym, like, a couple blocks away from where I was living at the time. Mm -hmm. And it was like... This, oh god this guy had been shitty to uh, a patron and the patron like went and got some friends and a, someone to hold the camera and came back later and just like threw one hit at the dude and knocked him to the floor mm -hmm. because that's what a real fight looks like yep generally speaking you're gonna win if you're bigger and you're going to win if you hit first. Yeah, like a tank. Mm-hmm. There was a, uh, a study on uh, tank combat in World War II that, um, that showed that the one of the, if not the largest component of who was going to win a tank versus tank encounter was who fired first. Yep. Because the people who were fired upon first uh, were suddenly in the middle of a cardiac crisis. Mm-hmm. And, like, weren't thinking clearly. Generally speaking, once someone is hit, they're not going to hit back. If you hit someone and they then attack back, you fucked up. That's why that Bass Rotan video, as ridiculous as it is, is actually really accurate. Uh huh. It's just like, find literally anything and hit them with and it. Hit them with it. You go bam, bam, bam. You go bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Just right to the like, head or to the kneecap. Right to the groin, if you can get to the groin. <laughs> you always go for the groin if you can get to the groin. Go for the eyes. There's no such thing as uh, a sportsmanship in a, in a, in a real fight. <laughs> it looks like more looks like two nerds flailing ineffectually at each other. <laughs> it can look a lot like two nerds <laughs> flailing ineffectually at each other. Oh... Oh no, the yellow dart. Come back. Yeah, You're surrounded by green. How do I fix that? Uh, I don't know. What's the problem with them? I don't know. They were surrounded by green. Were they healing themselves? No. Because green usually refers to healing in this game's coding. They, they weren't responding to my... Oh, my... they were reviving then. Oh, that makes sense. Kirby, 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 that's a name you should know. Oh. Okay. I thought I had I thought I had all my juice. Right back at you. I ya. really like the uh the way Fire Breath from Anjanath works in this game as compared to World. In World it's like a stream, a realistic stream that goes along the ground. Uh-huh. In this game it's just a fucking fire laser. story of some dude at a gas station throwing slurs until someone knocked them out in one hit with their phone as a blunt weapon. That sounds right. Huh, that's a weirdly familiar story. <laughs> I hope that's not about me. I would hate to think that my violence has spread. What are you talking about? We're, uh... Public figures and don't condone violence. Mm -hmm. I kind of fucked that up and didn't get in the tail hits I was like, going for. Yeah, it's whatever's happening to your dog right now. Mm -hmm. Uh, that yeah, that's healing. Okay. Nice. 
Anytime there's green, that's healing. Or, yeah, green always refers to health. It's like, wait, okay. what about the green spear bugs? No, no, that's also health. Those are the health bugs. I think we took the tail off? It's all yep. Over here. Nice. I just mowed it off like some kind of food processor for tails. Sometimes tails have to blend his food because it hurts his tummy. That's true. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you ever have one of those days where you're like, I've been doing this literally all day, and it's because I've been sick. Because, where, like, I've just sort of started putting words together and Markov chaining myself into just a massive feeling of, why, why am I like this? <laughs> been one of those nerds. I figured. I wasn't gonna say it unless you did. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, good. You pulled aggro. Because uh, if she had stayed on me, there is a chance she might have been able to kill me. So, thank you. And viewers like you. Thank you. From what I remember, the story ended with them saying something along the lines of, I'm assuming nobody had a problem with that, and then leaving. God, that may have been me. That sounds like something I'd say. Probably not, right? Yeah, probably not. We're public figures and don't condone violence, and certainly wouldn't uh, openly admit to causing violence. Mm-hmm. It's a tail here. Oh, right, thank you very much. Mm-hmm. Bad Road says, Christy, I'm always doing that inside my head. When I'm sick is when it falls out of my mouth. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm... That's where I'm at. Let's get this tail ham. Oh, she's resting. Well, oh. time to fuck that up. Uh, hang on, let me get over there with my series of big bombs. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go get into the sneak mode. Mountain. Yeah, I'm hiding behind this uh, this bush. It's the perfect. Cool. How do you engage sneak mode? Tap A. Tap A. Yes, I have engaged sneak mode. She's not sleeping. Um, we can try putting barrel bombs next. No, nope, there she goes. Uh, oh well. He has some butterflies. I'm not sure what those do. Uh, well, not quite how I wanted that to go down, but sure. I did the damage, so it's important. Yep. See, for a monster that we've broken basically all the pizzas off of, Incoming! it's still up. Oh yeah, it's 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 live. It's live, pal. Something's gonna happen on Saturday night. Here on WWF Shotgun Saturday Night. <laughs> God, I've forgotten that one. Yeah, right. Hey, did you want to watch wrestling at 11 p.m.? It's too early to be a proper insomnia cure. It's too like, late to watch it with friends. Like, hey, do you want, like, some matches with people you never see on the main roster and also a digest of all the promos you missed over the week. <laughs> Shotgun, Saturday night. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Aw, oh, dang. I got bitted. Yeah. Ouch. The show doesn't go on because it's ready. It goes on because it's 11.30, Lauren Michaels. Yep. Live from New York, it's WWE Shotgun. I think they don't do that one anymore. No. 
They do main event still. Main event is funny because it's literally not the main event. Yeah, main event is literally where they relegate the jobbers to. Mm hmm. What's that? Do Low you... card? That goes on main event. Do you want to watch Heath Slater do something really entertaining that you're never going to see again? <laughs> do you want to see uh, Dana Brooke being the accountant for the Titus brand? Get away. God, fuck, why did Titus wind up on main event? Oh, He's... because of the, um, because of the thing, I think. That thing where he grabbed Vince's arm that one time and he, and Vince slapped him. Oh, okay. So he pissed off Vince, so he put one of his best talents on the, on the, on the death show. I mean, he's done that a lot, is the thing. Yep. It's he's not a, here to make a profit or entertain you. It's here for Vince. Yep. He's a small, petty man. We can capture this animal. Yeah, I'm just grabbing some bones real quick. Oh, okay. I'm gonna... You got a trap ready? E yeah, hang on. Alrighty. Now lead her over to it. Uh, I have placed it down where I am standing. Alright, you may want to get out of the way. Nope. I know Titus, the software company, and Christopher Titus, the comedian, but not Titus, the wrestler. Titus O'Neil is a very good professional wrestler. Mm -hmm. um, he's he's big even by WWE standards. Uh, he's uh, he's from all accounts a really cool dude. He's really really good at when he fucks something up, turning that into part of his gimmick. Yeah. So Titus. Uh, O'Neal is the guy that... So the WWE held this event called the Greatest Rumble at in fucking... Uh, in Qatar? Not Qatar. Saudi Arabia. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was a shit show for just a lot of reasons, starting with the fact that they were taking um, literal blood money to perform a private show uh, mm -hmm. for... For royals. For royals. Uh, and sort of working out from there. But they had what they termed the biggest Royal Rumble in history, with more entrants than had ever been in a Royal Rumble before. Which is good, uh, because before then it had always been 30. There had been a couple of uh, 40 ones, but not a lot. Oh, I thought it had always been 30. It It's mostly been 30. Also, I'm pretty sure there's been independent Royal Rumbles that were uh, that were over a hundred people. So those aren't Royal Rumbles because Royal Rumble is a trade registered trademark of World Wrestling Entertainment. Ah, that's the catch. Yeah. So he part of the problem with having 50 people in a Royal Rumble as opposed to 30 is that there's just a lot more meat slipping around, and everybody's oiled up because they're wrestlers right especially and, the ones who have to look shiny yeah especially the ones that have to look shiny so there's a lot of like grease about and i mentioned that because uh during the rumble it uh there's like a cl countdown clock for waiting for the next person to come in and three two one and and then titus's music plays and he comes out and he goes running full tilt down the aisle at the ring and the camera is like following him from the other side of the of the ring like we're seeing through the ropes all the way across the ring at titus running at us yeah i i hear that uh and he gets up to the ring and then he just vanishes mm -hmm. and everyone's sort of like what happened there what happened to titus and then uh, we see the replays, and presumably the announcers are seeing the replays at the same time. Because what had happened was Titus had found some grease on the floor, had slid, but going as fast as he did, he slid just flat down to the floor all the way underneath the ring. He just completely vanished. 
it was a beautiful moment and nobody had their shit. Like everyone was just losing it, laughing at just this wild thing that happened. And then like he hid under the ring as his gimmick for the next uh, like six months as part of his gimmick. <laughs> Sorry, I got in the middle of that. I didn't know we were needing to do a cutscene. Yeah. Freckles, another large wave of rampaging monsters is upon us. And the wind serpent Ibushi is driving the horde from behind. Your task will be to slay the beast. The villagers defending the stronghold will do their best to draw Ibushi out. As usual, you'll be standing by inside. The calamity that threatens Kamara ends today. All right, Freckles, our fate is in your hands. Now go get to it. All right, so presumably this is the final rampage for high rank. Da -da -da -da. I've been waiting for An urgent quest has come in for you. Freckles, the time has finally come to slay Wind Serpent Ibushi. Though my sister is putting on a brave face for the village, deep down she's suffering. If only I had her power, I would gladly take her place. Ugh, why am I... S Forgive me. <laughs> Freckles, I beg you, please, please save the village. Save my sister. Special quest is coming for you. Let's save the village, save her sister. Um, yeah, can we do that? Not, not tonight. Yeah. Let me look at this. Serpent God of Wind. We have not finished all of the... We have not finished all the key quests, so it's like last time where this isn't actually the boss technically as we can do it before we finish the key quest, which means there is going to be um, proper seven stars, so that's good. I don't know how long this game goes on. Mm -hmm. All right. We'll find out. Uh, Sunbreak comes out in June, so there's that. Must have lost track of the story. What does Hinwa need help with? She uh, has uh, empathy with monsters, like psychic empathy. So when the monsters are rampaging her... She, it, it like hurts her and the last time that she saw the the wind serpent which was in a cutscene after the last big rampage we did she like had a bit of an an episode and like collapsed mm -hmm. so we have to get rid of ibushi because psychic interference yes that yeah! <laughs> Okay. <laughs> what I just did there won't make any sense to Christy. All right. Yeah, I feel like I was being chastised a little bit. <laughs> no, I was just doing something to leave the to 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 lead the stream. Okay. To to lead the stream to its conclusion. Okay. Anyway, assuming the internet keeps working like this, um, then tomorrow, Andrea is gonna play Final- or no, Andrea's gonna play Skyward Sword. It's also Grocery Day, so I don't know. We'll figure it out. It is- yeah, it was Monday. Just... Alright. Uh, Wednesday will be more of us playing Monster Hunter Rise, and Bad Road on his channel will be playing Second Sight. Thursday, Alice will play Stranger of Paradise Final Fantasy Origin, and Andy will probably play Tunic, but maybe something else on his channel. Friday, Katie will play Kingdom Hearts 2. Oh yeah, Thursday is a doctor's appointment, so it all depends on if Alice feels up to streaming after that. Uh, Saturday, someone on the Xenon Fiber channel will be playing Kingdom Hearts. Sunday, Christy will be continuing Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Uh-huh. And Monday, Andy will be continuing their run of Tunic and or something different. Once again on their channel, Andy Monium. And there's also a wild card stream, which is what this was. So remember that. Here's our YouTube channel. Our name if you is just Carolyn. If you just can't get enough of us, we're there. We're up, we're down, we're all around. We're far, we're near, we're usually sincere. 
we try to be sincere. <laughs> Except, you know, for comedy purposes. All right. Uh, I guess that's it. Thanks for joining me, Christy. Happy to. And thank you all out in the audience for joining me. My name's Sue. I hate video games. Give my regards to the next frog you meet.